Three laps were scary, but fun. What made it scary? Just the curves? The yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did he do so, anything special? To like, uh... he, was, he was drifting a couple of times, but the G-force in that corner is ridiculous. But it was fun. It was a lot of fun. Do you know what you're going to choose in terms of the seat and the suspension? I'm going to go for the sports. Always the sports. Because sport. I, I like speed, so I'm going to go for the sports for sure. It matches you up. Well. Yes. <laughs> sports for sports. Fast for fast. It works out. <laughs> And uh, you came from uh, Narita Airport with Mark Weber driving, and he might expect you on your toes. And again, as we said, you were at Grand Prix earlier. So, what was that experience for you like? Well, with Mark Weber, it was wonderful. Uh, we 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 came in and we were we had a lead car. We were trying to push him to go faster in the GTR and. He kept on pushing, pushing until he just decided that he was gonna <laughs> just go past them. So we had a, a good time coming in. It was it was exciting for me. Uh, today at the track was a once in a lifetime opportunity for me. I really enjoyed it. Uh, test two different type of GTRs, the sports one, the more more luxury one. So for me, it was it was really exciting, and I can't explain it. it was it was just joy for me. It was just a joy for me because I like speed and I really enjoy driving fast. So for me to be in a GTR safe as I know it is, and to go as fast as you can go, it was a wonderful feeling. And uh, there's a GTR waiting for you downstairs as well, and waiting with them, uh, with the GTR, are a lot of fans, including a lot of children, and I know that you have a foundation that's dedicated to the uh, development, the educational and cultural development of children. Could you tell me a little bit about that and how GTR um, functions and factors into that? Well, uh, this GTR will be auctioned off uh, to, to raise funds for for the kids, uh, we're going to do different, different things. Uh, mainly, we always start from the school era to develop uh, the younger kids uh, in every way, give them uh, computers, uh, more learning books and stuff like that. So uh, my motto is the kids are the future. So that's why I base my foundation on the fact that developing the kids of Jamaica and hopefully around the world in the soon. <laughs> 